Geese off tonight. No Mitchell Moses for the Eel. Meaning Arcee at round of the half. Welcome to what will be the final Parramatta home game of the season. Probably my final Parramatta vlog potentially. I think the season's almost over. Will Penasini, you heard him. I hope he'll score first. I can see that any time. And I reckon Suwali will score. And I feel like Hopwood might score as well. Parramatta, I think they're going to ambush this. I reckon they're going to win by six. 26 to 20. I think it'll be a high scoring game. And there's a few changes that are questionable. But I do think we can get the job done for the fans here. Last home game of the season. And Campbell Gillard is back from suspension along with Micah Sebo. Alright, Reese is here, first try scorer and score prediction. Reese is about to come out. Michael Sebo, first try scorer yeah. and 20 points to 12 prediction off the score. Oh, low scoring game, I like it. Without Mitch, it could be that. Let's go! Tedesco kicks it down to RC. It's going to go to Campbell Gillard returning from suspension and he's going to be tackled 12 metres out of our own line. Really, really simple, silly error there from Regan Campbell Gillard. The roost is going to attack now, second tackle. They're 14 metres out. Played the ball sideways. Hutchinson gives it to Radley. Three tackles gone. Come on, boys, hold on. Yeah! And Kiri loses the ball in that attacking opportunity for the Roosters. Nice little offload out back there. Three tackles gone. Oh, go, Brownie! Go, Kiri! Keep going! Looking good, looking good. Well, tackle. Nice cut right. Campbell Gillard! Crash play. Oh, still going. Hold up. He is held up. All right, kick to the Roosters. Simple kick there, that was silly. Really silly. Come on, defend, defend, defend. They both got the ball, but nice defend. And this sets up fifth for the Roosters. They've still got one more chance. The kick from Kiri. Oh, no. Oh, covered by Arcee. He's back in the field of play. Close. Uh, I think he's lost it before the line. I do. We'll find out. Oh wow! Oh wow! I actually didn't expect that, but I'll take it. And it is a four-pointer. Fast score goes to Bryce Cartwright. Yeah! All right, Reese Scutho with the goal kick. What do you think? Oh, I reckon you'll get it. Reckon you'll get it. I reckon you'll get it. <laughs> From the right hand side. Straight over the black dot. Six points to nil against the Roosters. Come on, sir. Do that. Back to slate. <laughs> Juniors, a few good runs here. 
Well, that's the second. Six nil to the Eels. Fifteen minutes gone. Tackle, Teddy. That's a big ten. Yeah, tackle him. Fifth tackle for the Roosters. Seventeen meters out. Kiri puts in a kick. It's towards Swaliti. He does get it. He passes to Billy Smith. He gives it to Swaliti. He's taken out. He's taken out. That is fantastic by Parra there. Go! Go! Junior! Go! Yeah, Will! Yes! Yes, boy! What a try! Brilliant team effort! Oh, why must you say no try? Why? Oh, you're kidding me. I couldn't say it from this angle, but Will, he's lost the ball. Oh, no. Oh, no! Fifth tackle here. I don't expect much from this set, but I want to see a better attacking kick. Dylan kicks it. There are chases. Oh, the Roosters getting a good run there. They shouldn't have gotten six more here. They might score in this set. They shouldn't have had six more given to them. Bradley's got the ball. Gives the butcher. Oh, he's still going. Gutho held him up. Held up. Why are we still looking at this? Oh, it's play on time. Gutho's held Brandon Smith up, said Matt Butcher before. Why are we checking for a try? We all could have told you it was no try. Oh, Radley, Radley, Radley held up. Oh, great tackle, great tackle. Who is that? It's Luca. No, it's Madison, fresh off the bench and Joey Lutte. An intercept drop, Brewster's getting the ball back here. 16 minutes to go in the first half. Paramount is 6 0. I'll tell you what, they have turned up to play tonight. Let's go through and Tesco scores. Brewster's 4, Neil 6. 15 minutes left in the first half. Oh my god, it was literally the same play as last week in Brisbane. Everybody jammed in from a scrum. They go out to Swanley here, man, and now they take the lead, 10 points to 6. I haven't learned from Brisbane last week some of the creative plays that teams can do. Silly. Come on, Swale, he missed this one. That's a good kick, he's got it. That's got it! Come on, Pam. Fifth tackle here. 6-12 to the Roosters. Brown, Gutherson, Pedersini. He's fifth. What the hell? Looks like Woodham and Greg. Yeah, it is. Has been injected into the action as Gutherson, middle of the field, tries to dummy. Brought down by two defenders, Smith and Crichton. They go to the left wing here, and Arcee is just not providing anything so far. And six more here. Fresh play. Here we go, Gutherson. Here we go. Oh man, he didn't pass it to the right edge. That's fourth tackle. Can't right, thick pass. Pedersini walked down. Fifth to last. Gutherson puts in the kick. There's Roosters there. Suwali has been covering kicks all night. Suwali! Oh no. Oh no. Tedesco, get him down, get him down. Roosters, they are starting to get on top and starting to get on our nerves. Well, there's 30 seconds in the half, and we get a scrum feed. Good run there, would have been great. Down 18 points to six. We can score before half time and make it 18 12. Never know what can happen. Came back against the Dragons a few weeks ago. Six again, 20 seconds to go. Campbell Gillard tackled, they're trying to slow it down. Come on. Big Woodamu, Greg. Eight seconds left. Touched by the Roosters, but but it's half time. It is half time. Unfortunately, it's not half time. Oh man. Dragon. 
Ruben is here from Peking Gas and I am loving it. They run on fifth. Oh, oh. Seba was taken out. Has that a penalty? Are you kidding me? Yeah. It was risky by the Eels there, but that should have been a penalty after half time. Come on. Good run by Jermaine. Offload, not held. Come on, Sebo's actually had some really good attacking runs here, so it'd be cool to see a Sebo try after half time. I not a Sebo try in a while, a long time really. Campbell Gillard setting up with fifth. Come on, boys. Come on, Dylan. No, go to Dylan. Arcee, kick put in. Bruce has got it. They should have gone to Dylan there. I don't know why they went left. Roosters kicking to the corner and Parramatta come up with it. Oh man, Suwali has been having some great takes all night. Fifth the last here. Gutherson doesn't get it, it goes out though. So captain's challenge from the Roosters here. It, it touches Manu's right hand. I've got a Gutherson in the background. Based on all available angles, we're unable to overturn the line decision. The Roosters will kick their challenge. Yeah. You're about it's a Parramatta feed. Season on the line here, this set. 28 minutes to go. Oh, man. Three letters, four points. Three letters, four points. Try. Joseph Swalini. He scores his second of the match. Roosters 22, Eels 6. They shouldn't have even had a penalty there. I'll tell you what, the urgency of this club is absolutely not there in recent weeks. I don't understand how we start so well for 25 minutes and then go absolutely missing as the Roosters lead 22 to 6, 23 minutes to go. And I see the Roosters about to put on a score. I'm going to put out a full-time score prediction right now of 34 points to 10. Set here, RC, de decent kick, decent kick. Chasers, chasers, not gone, not gone, not gone. Mato, Gutho, 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 go, go, kick put in. Swalini takes it, why we kick it? And why wasn't it called a six more? Come on, Sebo, pick it up and run. Pick it up, just go. Run, Bala. Pick up the crunch. 14 minutes to go, down by 10. I do still believe in this win. I still do believe in this win. And there goes Parramatta in 2023. Even without Tedesco, the Roosters, they get it done. 10 minutes to go, it's 26 12, kick to come. It's all over. Lots of Parramatta fans. Leaving as they know the season comes to an end tonight here at Combank. Can I just say guys, there's 10 minutes to go. Come on guys. I know it's tough. Support your team through thick and thin. I know the season's over. I know people want to hit the hakes of traffic. You don't leave a game like this in the numbers. It's, it's embarrassing for the club. 20,000. You don't have 20,000 in a minute. Next one. Parramatta get the ball back off a short drop and a short kick off. I don't want to lose this by like four or six points. I just don't even want to bother, you know? Offload, Campbell Gillard, Gutherson, offload, Brendan Hands, tackle, third tackle. Dylan Brown caught out by Manu. Also Butcher. Gutherson's got the pass. 28 to 12 to the Roosters. A Sebo try might be coming. A Sebo try. Oh my god, he's gonna get pushed out. Possible. But they are gonna say a penalty to Parramatta here. Roosters chance go up as Parramatta have a great attacking opportunity. Bryce Cartwright looking for his second and the ball's come out. And the Roosters can't 
Keep going, Gil. Oh, fuck. That would have been a great individual try there. They've moved a bit closer to the field now as well. I thank the players this season. I haven't got much to say at the moment. I pretty much got the score bang on from what I said when I knew we were going to lose this game. Full time here with the great man Hainsey. 34 to 12 to your boys. Uh, you've got the Tigers next week. You've got the Rabbitohs massive game in two weeks. How much belief do you have in the Roosters coming into the finals? Belief is there, mate. Belief is there. Um, I'm really proud of the effort tonight to start with. Yep. Um, yeah. Just. We still look off in the tack. That first 20 minutes we were poor. But we just settled into the game, got on the roll, and yeah, just our attack was too good tonight. Two games to go, level points of the eight. We need Newcastle to do us a favour. Beat South on Sunday. Beat the Tigers. South have the bye. Round 27 with a good lock on points. Play each other and call it. Imagine that. Tell you, what, tell you what, Joseph Suwali against Parramatta. He is just a machine. Every time he plays against us, gives us nightmares. Do you yeah. think the Roosters are going to miss him when the time comes to send him over to the Union? <sighs> it's tough. It's tough. Like, you know... He's been so good the last few weeks back on the wing where he belongs. Yeah. Like it, it, and no disrespect to Sebo, he's a great winger, but winger, uh, oh my God. Sebo was quiet tonight, did nothing, really did nothing. Still elite, he just got him on the outside, too quick, too strong. It, it was incredible tonight. Who, um, who do you think was Parramatta's best player tonight? I didn't mind Bryce Cartwright. Yeah, I agree. I Bryce think Cartwright. It, but when I, the, early on in the game, I was like, We've got to stop these offloads because they're killing us through the middle. Mm. And it was tough with no Jarry, but the boys stood up. Terrell May, Fletcher Baker, those who... Uh, so sad that we're losing Fletcher, but Terrell May's a play for the future. CY Wong, also another great player. Uh, but yeah, Lindsay was awesome tonight as well. But yeah, just all around good performance. Still a lot to work on. Victor Adler dropped the ball six times. You know, we can't let that happen against South. So, but look, win's a win. Keep on rolling. We're still alive in the 10th spot. Eleven points at the eight. Anything can happen. Well, you'll be here next week for the Combank game against the Tigers. Good You're my good mate. luck charm, Hayden. You're going to come next week. No, nah, I'm not going to be there. Put mate. a Tiger jersey on every time you put the opportunity. No, nah, I got my uh, I got my cousin's first birthday, mate. I oh, won't be no. there, unfortunately. I know. It shocks me. But anyway. they're Roosters supporters, so I put a Roosters shirt on for you, mate. Thanks, mate. Vegas, 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 Vegas. Full-time, 34 points to 12. Disappointing in the last home game of the season. We we're always going to miss Mitch, but the kicking game was bad. I thought the forwards were good. I thought Campbell Gillard and Junior Paulo, um, which I, I don't often think they're both great. I think it's always one or the other, but I thought they were both good. Um, I thought Bryce Cartwright was fantastic tonight. Um, he's been one of the best players all year for us, really. Um, Gutherson had some highs and lows, probably some more lows than highs, but... Yeah, disappointing uh, result and probably the end of Parramatta's season now. Uh, we have to play Penrith and then we have the bye. So no more home games. And uh, look, hopefully Parramatta can find a way to make top eight. But I, uh, I, I think it's pretty unlikely. I think it's been uh, a dismal season. I liked our win against the Rabbitohs. I might do a full season review on that. But um, yeah, make sure you guys like this video, subscribe to the channel. I hope you guys enjoyed the content running into Hainsey and stuff was good. And uh, I will see you guys for the Knights taking on the Rabbitohs on Sunday. I'm looking forward to that one.